Good Friday, guys. It is finally the weekend. I'm so tired because I woke up this morning, if you guys watched my last vlog, um, and I, I just did like so many workouts starting at 6 a.m. and I'm exhausted. But tonight, we are going to Carbone, which has been open in Dallas for a few months now. We, my friends and I just like keep forgetting to make a reservation. Anyways, I finally made a reservation. So we are going tonight and I think I'm gonna wear this Revolve top. And these shoes, I'm like so inspired again, style-wise now, because it's fall, I think. Well, okay, it's not really fall, but like I always say, I woke up and I decided it was fall, so it's fall to me. Um, and obviously this isn't like a fall look, but just the season approaching, it makes me so excited to get dressed. And then I also want these cute little sling back heels this week from Sam Elvin and they came in the mail so quick and I just thought they were so cute. So I'm gonna see if I like this together. I have the Dallas pants, like my go-to pants. So we'll see, keep you guys posted one step. All right, so this is the outfit that I'm actually gonna go with. I'll probably have to show you guys in the mirror, um, I think, because the Dallas pants, it was just too much black. And the whole point of this top is that it's a longer top. So I wanted to like make sure you could see that. You couldn't really see it on black as much. And I think it's cuter with the jeans with the kitten heels. And then I'll probably wear my Chanel bag, I think. I think I'm gonna wear my new Peyton Sarton Bird Life ones. Wow, such a classy girl these days. And like, depending on how hot it gets, I might pull my hair back and I have like the perfect little black scrunchie, so. Okay, this is the look. I kind of feel like chic and cute. And then I also kind of feel like mother. Tan on my feet is also messed up, but you know, you win some, you lose some. So I think I like the look. I think it's cute. Like my hair might look better pull back, but I'll wait for that. There we go. I'm calling it a day. Guys. <laughs> my really crazy camera setup. They don't pay me the big bucks for nothing. Been in this for long enough. You look great. Okay, so um, Lauren and I are gonna taste test some canned espresso martinis before dinner tonight. We've been waiting all week. It's golden hour. If you guys are wondering why my Instagram and Lauren's Instagram was looking so great last fall, it's because of that light. And I just charged it. Bring that with us when we like travel. We've done so many trips this year. <laughs> I was thinking about that. No, I was thinking about that. We made our vision boards for 2022, and it was so many girls trips. We've done like five. Yeah, we nailed it. We really, we and we're going out one this week. We have like three more plans before the yeah. year. Yeah, we need to book New Year's Eve. Okay, a pre. It's two girls in Dallas, actually. So we're gonna do a little taste test. I'm trying to do the classic. I kinda wanna do a normal one. I mean, a, like a, oh, a flavored one? Do you say caramel or caramel? Caramel. We'll do a taste test and then we will, um, it's wine. Wine base. Oh no, will I fall? Wait a second, I'm gonna fall asleep. Maybe not, it has espresso in it. It's agave wine, so it's like a tequila wine. Right, right up my alley. I've never heard of her, but I've no idea. That's actually very good. This one is. This one's very this. different. Cause well, I've never had a vanilla espresso martini here. Cause I, this actually, it doesn't taste like one that you would like get at a bar. Oh, it's, no, I like the vanilla one better. JC on TikTok said that these are, some of their margarita glasses. And I was like, are they? Okay, wait. The one that Kendall Jenner follows? <laughs> yeah, yeah, actually. I'm sure everyone is um, well versed in the JC Kendall Jenner, Jenner, Jenner drama. It gets crazier by the day. It does. And speaking of which, you should listen to all of our episodes that I have on the podcast with what we said and there's so much podcast. We have about five or six podcast episodes out there. Really good. One of my top listen to episodes are navigating our 20s. Okay, I love the coffee butter. Really? Yeah. I like the vanilla better. I honestly think I like it better in the can though than I even do in a glass. Ah. I think I like this one better. This is what I need tonight as I pregame drink now. Ah. We ah. really need this. All right guys, mark time now. Um, I'm making this margarita that I made with this like red clay salt, but I'm out of lime to salt the rims. Don't want to talk about it. Um, here we go. Two ounces Blanco tequila. Thank you. Dun, dun, dun. One is just one ounce, right? Now we have orange liqueur, half an ounce. One ounce fresh lime juice, but do we think this is lime juice or? It's lemon? lime concentrate. One ounce fresh lime juice, don't even worry about it. Guys, we got you covered. And then half an ounce of red clay hot, hot honey. Sure. Sauce. <laughs> <laughs> I was really tripped up about it. Syrup. All right, and now we go. You know, the last time I made this was incredible. So if it wasn't good this time, I don't know what to tell you. It's 
It's actually really good. <laughs> Told you guys. I can't believe this is good. Thank you. No offense. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I'm actually good at making margs. That's why I was just like, wait, I don't. I just like forget how I make them. You just have three ingredients, and so I just thought there was no way. No, but that's how you make it. I never use margarine. So I hate to tell you this, Bestie, but I like my full body. You want your full body now? <laughs> okay. All right, well, back to the drawing board, guys. We've gotta take some more pics. Uh... You're the best assistant. <laughs> morning and I'm about to head off to the farmer's market trying a new one new get some coffee but this is my look so my jumpsuit one piece whatever you want to call this is from girlfriend collective they have my favorite ones they just are so flattering they're great and I also have boxing this morning and this is what I'm gonna wear this sweater is from reformation and I'm telling you guys like the little bit of a splurge I feel like it's like it's not a cheap sweater but it's like fairly priced for the quality and what this is, but this sweater I bought for Nantucket and I wear it all the time. Like it is just such a good staple piece. My purse and then I would wear cuter sneakers, but I'm going boxing so I'm wearing like my Brooks. They're cute, but I mean like I would wear like more stylish like day to day sneakers. So anyways, we are heading off. I'm so happy. I love a good farmer's market moment and boxing like Love. Cool. Thank you. Have a good day. Okay. Ooh. Hold on, guys. It is so bright right now. This new drive through Starbucks is like, I, I'm there all every day. Like, literally every day. All right, guys. I just got my coffee. Here we go. My coffee order is on the highlights of my Instagram always if you guys are in line and you need to order. I'm actually on my way to the farmer's market and I'm going to a different farmer's market. It's called the St. Michael's Farmer's Market. I'm not quite sure why, but it's more like Park City's area. Last week I went to the Dallas Farmer's Market and I just want to test out different ones. I'm passing sprouts right now. Love you. Maybe I'll be there tomorrow. Um, so I'm going to do that. I don't know if I want to go out tonight or do anything. I feel like I just am not, not feeling it at all. It's so much more fun going out October through May and like the rest of the year. Everyone's just gone traveling all the time for summer and then it's like hot, you know, and at the fall and springtime here going out is so much fun. Summer is just like hot and half my friends are out of town all the time anyways. So like that's what the struggle is currently. No one cares. Anyways, going to the farmer's market, going to boxing, having quite a healthy uh, weekend vibe if you will. Why did I say vibe? Because I don't, I'm tired. I'm really sorry. Just ignore me. Okay, goodbye. Just finished at the farmer's market. It's pretty small. It's not like there's like a ton of stuff. In a way, it's nice because it's not overwhelming. I did like that it was smaller. Yeah, it, it was it was cool. I think I want to try other ones. I did like it though. Got these flowers. I'll show you guys a haul later. I'm really excited because I did get okay. Well, the sauerkraut is at the bottom, so we'll show you guys. I'll show you that later. But everyone was really nice. It was super cute. Smaller, easier. Parking was totally fine. Also, I'm leaving on Wednesday, so I didn't want to buy like too much. I got chicken and just some things that I'll make for dinner and stuff, but um, I didn't want to go too crazy because obviously I'm only here for a few more days, so. Anyways, um, it's 10 a.m. I don't have boxing until 11.20, so I might actually take all this stuff home and then go to boxing. I think that's the plan. <sighs> what a good Saturday morning. Okay, guys. Um, so I actually realized that I'm exhausted, so I moved boxing to tomorrow instead because I have to wake up early anyways, so it just like, made more sense. But I'm gonna do a little farmer's market haul. I have these beautiful flowers. Um, I brought this bag so that I wouldn't be given bags. 
and then some people still gave me back. So, anyways, so cute. Again, I'm barely here, so not sure what I was thinking because this is a thirty dollar bouquet. So, oh, oops, 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 oops. Like I die for flowers in like paper wrapping, newspaper especially. Oh my god, die. I don't know. For now, we're gonna do this, but uh, probably not the vibe. Yeah, not the vibe. But uh, this works for now. Cute. Next, I got these two sauerkrauts, Kyoto and the wild dill. Obviously, sauerkraut is really good for you. What do you guys put this on? Like, you can basically put this on anything, but I need to know from y'all. It also looks really good. The way they make these too, there's no like sugar, or even water added. It. He was like, it's like literally the vegetables and then like the pink salt or whatever. Cosmic cultures, exciting. A bunch of peaches. I got, oh, well that's unfortunate. Okay. I got two frozen chickens and this is from 840 Farm. I got the last of the chicken breast. They were like 82 and they all were sold by like 11, which is crazy. Must be good. It's my farmer's market haul for today. Probably be making my peach chicken dish that I'm obsessed with, as you know, that I keep making. Probably tomorrow, so. I think Amanda and I are gonna go on a walk and just get some matcha. I am so tired and it's crazy because like I didn't even stay out late. Like I literally went to bed by like 11. Didn't even go out, so I don't know. And I had like two real drinks total, so. I don't know what's going on with me guys, I'm not sure. This tote from the Okine is the best farmer's market tote, the best grocery store. Store toe, I mean the best toe for everything. Like literally use it for everything. We're on a walk. All bark, no bite. That's fits. We're walking to get some matcha. I'm with Amanda. I'm trying to get Fitz to do a little running and he did about one lap and he's not interested anymore. Dude, what are you doing? Come here, bud. Got some matcha. So good. Water-based matcha. I just showered, which I was planning on doing later. I can't decide if I want to go hang out during the day or go to dinner tonight. Part of me wants to go to Chuckyard during the day and then just have a night, like night home alone. I never have things planned on Sunday. So since I have like quite the day tomorrow, I'm like, I really just, I don't know. I haven't decided, but I did order lunch from Sweet Green. Hi, Coco, cutie. My normal lunch, so good. I'm just gonna sit in bed and eat and eventually I'll have plans. All right guys, I somehow got out of bed and got convinced to go day drink. I'm gonna get a drink. I hope I go to HG because I really want a snack. They got rid of my um, vegetable hummus and the tequila based smash drink that I loved. So like we're kind of on the outs, um, but like I need some food or I really want queso basically. Anyways, my top is Aritzia. Pants are the O kind, the Dallas pants. They're literally the most flattering pants ever. They're so comfortable. Shoes are New Balance. I got them on Goat, Chanel, Aura. And then I'm wearing, let me show you, these really cool, like, dang, oh, dangly earrings. And they're actually Kendra Scott, so. That is the look. I just blew out my hair really quickly. Did, like, two-minute makeup. I'm so tired, but I'm like, it's Saturday. I need to go, like, see some friends. I'm not gonna go anywhere tonight. Just have, like, a chill night in. Very weird weekend for me. Like, this is not, I'm normally out and about and out, but... Not this weekend, guys. I'm very tired. Ooh. We're going to truck yard right now. Lauren just said that's us. So we're in cowboy boots. It's cute. The yeah, that's birthday party. yeah, she just told me it's one's birthday party, so uh, bye. <laughs> Below. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, craziest thing just happened. It is midnight, and I'm uh, just now getting home. And I, I'm as shocked as the rest of us because this isn't one of those things where it's like, oh, I wasn't gonna go out, and like, oh, I ended up out. No, like, I really, really wasn't going out. And uh, yeah, I just got back. But I will say, midnight, it's kind of an early night for me. Taking these undo the booze, like hangover pills, after alcohol herbal supplements. I'm taking those tonight. Um, I've been drinking, but like nothing crazy. I was really just taking out friends. I really 
really genuinely like honest to god thought I'd be home by 6 p.m. So anyways, so I went to the truckyard and then I went and I was like, you know what? Screw it. I'm gonna go with my friends at their place and go to dinner because they had already asked me and I said no. And then I, I went back on that. And then when I was at dinner, I got some text from friends and I was like, you know what? Screw it. I'm gonna go see my friends. And before you know it, it's midnight. So um, that's where we're at today. Anyways, um, Danielle Rompe is in town tomorrow, so I'm getting coffee with her at like 8 or 9. So I'm gonna go to bed immediately. Tomorrow's not gonna be what I thought it was gonna be, you know? Hi guys, happy Sunday. It is currently 8.30. I'm about to go pick up my friend, Danielle. She has a podcast with Jeremy Media. She's also a host. Like, she's on E. She's very cool, badass. Very great girl, love her. So she's in town for the day, so we're gonna get coffee this morning. Um, I'm so tired. Unbelievably tired. But we're going to, uh, it's like the funny library coffee shop. Whatever it's called, I forget. It's really cute in the Virgin Hotel. So I'm gonna go pick her up. And we're gonna go do that. I already can feel... Sunday today calls for a nap, calls her maybe some reading, and maybe making dinner. Maybe. Slow day. It's currently 4.14 p.m. I've ordered Zap, got my nails done, and this is my post self tan outfit. And I'm going to bed at eight. I didn't even stay out crazy late last night. I had four drinks the entire day. And because I've not been drinking that much, like I feel my brain fog's just bad. You know, whatever, I need to get back. I'm excited to wake up in the morning, go on a walk, work out. Like, you know, I just, ugh, not great. So anyways, I'm gonna end today's vlog because all I'm gonna do is eat food, read, look on Zillow, and maybe watch some videos. So I hope you guys enjoyed this week of my life vlog. Um, we have a lot of cool vlogs coming up, some reading vlogs, going to LA this week, lots of stuff's happening. So anyways, love you guys so much and I'll talk to you soon. Bye. You know, sometimes humans, we tend to make life decisions out of a spreadsheet and then out of researching a lot and we exhaust ourselves to a point that you're like, okay, this one, because you know, yeah. like non resonate. So I'm going to expand my, you know, options and I'm going to just pick one.